Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to that Chelsea career mode. It is your boy Sonny. Welcome back to Bros Guy Game. You guys probably know we are in second in the table. If you guys don't know that, I think I showed you at the end of the last episode. Make sure you check that out in the outro coming up at the end of this video, man. But we're on eight points as well as four other teams Stoke City, Fulham, Manchester City and Tottenham Hotspur so hopefully we can get to the top of the table within this episode is it gonna happen though we're going into our first game against Stoke City a beast team we don't want to be going up against them in career mode a lot you know they're a great team in this game in FIFA 13 a, a tall team you know that probably lacking the pace and it shows there as Falcao slots in the first goal in the 12th minute and it looks beast. You know, as soon as Dembabar played that through ball through, he's on his left foot and you know he's putting it into the back of the net. Makes it 1-0. Again, Falcao on the ball, plays it through to Ramirez. Ramirez on the ball on that right wing. He's crossing it across goal, Dembabar. And both of our strikers are putting it into the back of the net. Both strikers, Dembabar and Falcao, I'm not sure what his first name is, but Falcao and Dembaba put it into the back of the net, making it 2-0, and that was the final score, man. But I want to talk to you guys about a few stuff, and this is the reason, all right? We just won that match 2-0 against Stoke City. We have a next match coming up against Celtic, but for some reason, my HDP VR kind of spazzed out, you know, my Celtic match... My goals were by Hazard and Demba Bahupa scored for Celtic, which means it was 2-1 to Chelsea. I won the game, but my HDPVR decided it was going to have a shitty day. <laughs> and we were halfway through the Arsenal game when I realized, guys. So look at that. We're leading 1-0 halfway. So it's half time and Falcao was the goal scorer for that. So hopefully we can pull off some more goals in this game. Or are Arsenal going to come back? You know, my HDPVR had a shitty day. I was like, what the hell, man? Now everybody's not going to see my first goal. And they're not going to see the other goals that were scored against Celtic and Celtic's goal. But we did win that match 2-1. And we come back into the game and Arsenal win a penalty. Ramirez taking out Podolski picks up a yellow card and I was like what the hell man we could have we could have pulled off a great clean sheet here if it wasn't for Podolski sending the hair the wrong way in the 50th minute we could have pulled off a, a beast clean sheet against a great team I believe we're at the um, Emirates or are we at Stamford Bridge? We're at the Emirates and Ramirez is through. A great ball from Falcao. It's still Ramirez. He's going to sweat that across. Falcao, a nice little flick into the goal. Falcao, 65th minute, gets his second goal of the game. And you guys let me know, what do you think about sweaty goals? Do you think it's great to get into those kind of positions? Or do you think, what the hell, you just sweated a goal? Like, um, like, how, do you feel like KSI and Kyle Freezy and those kind of players um, when a sweaty goal happens? Or do you think... What a great position to score it. Like Barcelona, you know. Barcelona does it a lot in real life. I think Manchester United... Uh, Manchester United? Manchester United saw some beast goals, man. Did you guys see how they won against um, Fulham that time? 4-1, I believe. Whoa, that was a great game for United, man. But I believe they got a game against Everton soon. I believe it's in like an hour or two. But yeah, this is probably going to be up after that. But hopefully we can win that game, man. It's a great game for us. Um... It's Monday, right? It's going to be Monday when this goes up, man. But hopefully we win that game. Hazard there making it 3-2 with a screamer. As you can see, it goes through to Falcao. Falcao on the ball. Still Falcao. We're going to slap that in for his hat-trick. And hat-trick for Falcao. I believe that's his second hat-trick since joining Chelsea. And he's turning out to be a beast, man. But you guys are probably thinking, why didn't Sonny upload on Saturday or Sunday? Why didn't AJ upload on Saturday and Sunday? It's because we're thinking of taking a break on the weekends. Tweet us what you think. Tweet us at Bros Guy Game. That link is in the description below. Also, if you are following us on Twitter, you would know that. Because we do our ladies updates on Twitter. They go there first. So make sure you follow us. That we're not going to be uploading on Saturday. Saturdays and Sundays hopefully we might upload if we get probably bored or something and we might think uh, well, you know what let's just upload for these guys man <laughs> but yeah we're not going to be uploading on Saturdays and Sundays that's most likely and we're going into our next game guys we did beat Arsenal 4-2 man we pulled off a big score there in a big game at the Emirates we're going to look at the table we're on 14 points with six games Chelsea at the top Manchester City Fulham, Wigan and Everton all on the same points just before, just behind us. So we want to be pulling off a great score. As you can see, it's Dembo here. Plays it through to Falcao. A nice little dummy. Still Falcao. He takes a shot. 1-0 to Chelsea in the 11th minute. You guys are going to see we actually play like beasts 
in this game. There's no way any team is stopping Chelsea by the looks of it. And a lot of you guys are asking me how to do that celebration right there. It's actually called the water hose. You guys are like the one that shoots them down. It's called the water hose, guys. It's not a gun thing. Peggy 3, you know, <laughs> it's in the game. <laughs> but Butterfield, their 24th minute, gets the go back for Norwich. But yeah, going back to that celebration, guys, it's called the water holes. You have to be level 70 on FIFA. If you're level 70, then go ahead and do the next steps I'm going to tell you. If not, then you're going to have to get some XP, you know, get some experience points and level up. As you can see, I sweated across gold, but it's a flick, so it sounds a bit nice. I mean, it looks a bit nice. Sounds a bit nice? I don't know. Did, did you hear the flick? I didn't hear no flick. I saw the flick. <laughs> but as you can see, Lampard plays it into Falcao. And again, Falcao is on his game. 31st minute, he gets a hat trick for Chelsea. His third hat trick for Chelsea. He's looking like a beast. Probably going to be one of the biggest players in Chelsea this season for us. Because we bought him. You know, we bought him for 35 million plus Fernando Torres, a lot of you guys are like, why did you do that? And now you're seeing why. You know, he's going there. He's getting his fourth goal. Whoa. Fourth goal against Norwich for Falcao. He, I believe he gets like, for, with that fourth goal there, it's his 14th goal this this season in the league. That's great, man. Demba Bar around the ball here. He's going to cut it back. You guys can watch these highlights. I'm going to tell you about that celebration, man. You have to be level 70 anyway. Go into your EASFC catalog. Go to level 70 and you're going to see it. You're going to see water holes celebration. You're going to want to buy that with some FIFA credits that you guys get for XP and stuff like that. Do the challenges on the EASFC uh, EA challenges. You go ahead and do that and you get FIFA credits for that. You get like 500 credits, I believe, or something like that. But yeah, just use that and then you'll get um, different stuff. Like you can get career pro attributes. You can get um, season financial um takeovers and stuff like that season matches um rematch um stuff like that i don't know man i don't know how to explain it man it's just so many stuff and look at that for a belter from lampard guys in the 86th minute straight after snodgrass scored for norwich and 86th minute lampard just does it straight from kickoff man a great goal for lampard but yeah you're gonna go ahead and buy that and then you get that celebration that's how you do it guys and then it's right trigger and down twice on your right thumbstick but look at that guys six two we beat norwich Four from Falcao, one from Denver Bar, one from Lampard, which means we're beasting it out. I'm sorry I couldn't show you guys that Celtic game. It was a good game. And the Arsenal goal, the first goal for Falcao, was actually quite a good goal. I wouldn't say it's as good as some of the goals you saw in that game there. But look at the table. We're winning. We're at the top with Chelsea with 17 points. I believe Chelsea was at the top in real life at the start of the season, man. Let me know in the comment section what you guys think of that. Manchester City and Manchester United just behind. They're usually at the top. And Chelsea's just behind them. But it's not happening now. So stay tuned for the next episode. Maybe we, maybe they will go ahead. I don't know. Can we hold that lead at the top of the table? Can we make it to the last 16 in the Champions League? You're going to have to wait and see, man. But let's see if we can hit 25 likes on this episode, guys. Follow us on Twitter at Bros Got Game. Like our Facebook page. Those links are in the description below. Share the video on Facebook, retweet the video, favorite the video, you guys know I love that stuff. Click those annotations, check out the last episode to the Chelsea Career Mode out there on the left. And my road to success off the mark as I join Manchester United on the right. A like and a comment is always appreciated as you guys know. Hit that subscribe button and join the family if you haven't already. It's been your boy Sonny and I'm signing out. Peace out. Come